So I'm going to show you how to install and adjust a saddle uh, on three of the most basic types of seat posts. So this is the first one. It requires a 6 mil Allen key. And all you're going to do is loosen off that bolt. And sometimes with this particular type, you need to loosen it a little bit more than you think. So if I were just to adjust it, then I just want to get it so that that will move, so that you're disengaging these little teeth in here. So sometimes it can jam and you have to kind of give it a little a bit of a push. So once that's nice and free, you can adjust the nose up, down, forward, and aft. All right. So if I wanted to completely replace this saddle, I'm just going to swivel that top piece so that I can take the saddle off. Simply put the new one on and tighten it up. I get it so that it's just kind of firm-ish and then when it's on the ground I can sort of micro, micro adjust it and when you're trying a new saddle a good place to start is with it completely level and it right in the middle of the rails here. So equidistance from the two ends. So sometimes it will only go a little bit with the nose up <laughs> or a little bit with the nose down. Sometimes you can't get it quite level so you have to kind of play around with it. All right, so that's one type. Another type uses a 5 mil Allen key right in here. And you just loosen that, and the whole thing just swivels. So you can slide it forward and aft. You can put the nose up or down. Another really common type uses a 4 mil Allen key here and here. So if you want the nose down, you tighten this. If you want the nose up, then you tighten that. In order to tighten one, you've got to loosen off the other one first. All right? So if I wanted the nose up a little bit, I would loosen off the one in the front, and then that would allow me to tighten the back, and the nose will swivel up. When you tighten it up, it should be, with this particular type especially, it should be really snug. You can strip these if you really wrench on them, so you don't want to do that but just make sure it's, it's good and firm. Check out more at bikebarn.ca.